Hi. Today, let's talk about creating and archiving classes in ExactPath. Creating classes allows educators to easily organize students and aggregate learner data. And it's an important part of setting up your ExactPath experience. Let's look at how it's done. Both administrators and teachers have the ability to create and archive classes in ExactPath. As an administrator, you must first click on My Classes at the top. Teachers will default to this page when they log in. Then click on Manage Classes. What displays is a list of all of your classes. You can choose to create a new class or archive older classes from this screen. We're going to start by walking through the steps it takes to create a class. First, I need to enter my class name. Remember that class names must be unique. Choose something recognizable or following the naming convention used in your district. From there, choose your instructor. I can also add multiple instructors that will be able to manage this class. Next, I must select my school and choose the grade associated with this class. Grade is optional, but if you do make a selection here, Remember that this is the system grade of those learners, not their functional ability level, which may be a little bit different. From below there, now I can select my students. I can use the search bar here to search for each of my students one by one. I can refine this list below by choosing a specific location or narrowing my focus further by grade level. Once I have my students, I can select the plus sign next to the name of the students I wish to add to my class. Notice that as I am doing this, they are populating below. I'll go ahead and add a couple more students here. And now below, I can see my class. Once I've confirmed that these are all the students I wish to add to my class, I can select Save Class. I will know that my class has been saved if it is now added to this list. At any point along the way, I can either delete my class if I made a mistake, or I can go in to edit my class to bump out a student or add any new students as appropriate. Now that you know how to create a class, let's talk about archiving old classes that are no longer needed. This is a great action to take at the beginning of a new school year to create a fresh start. Notice the boxes next to my classes. These allow me to archive. As soon as I check one of the boxes here, my blue button changes to archive selection. I can check one box, multiple boxes, or use the select all option at the top if I want to clear out all of my old classes at once. Once I've made my selections, I can select archive selection here. Notice additional details display to explain exactly what archiving means. Archiving a class simply removes the class from your view. This will not delete any previously completed student data. If I agree that this is the action I want to take, I would hit Yes, Archive Classes. For today, I will go ahead and cancel and not archive my classes. That wraps up everything you need to know about creating and archiving classes in ExactPath. Thank you for joining me.